Great car deals are just ahead and wholesale markets already down 23%. And how to bargain with a black book book out or a cash offer from KBB. Hi, I'm Kevin Hunter, the homework guy, here today with the amazing Elizabeth, the homework gal. Today we're going to share with you examples of where the car market is overall right now and conclude with some black book wholesale market insights that totally confirm what we're saying. Remember a couple years ago when we published, How much do used car dealers pay for cars? Easy to figure out. In that video, we taught you three methods to getting the wholesale cost of the vehicle you're shopping for. I'd like to add just one more method. It involves getting a cash offer from KBB. By the way, because we are booking out cars on a daily basis on BlackBook, I can tell you that the KBB cash offer number is right on the money with BlackBook rough trade numbers. Indeed it is. Mm -hmm. Now here's some current market examples. Our viewer, Emmanuel, emailed us to say, I'm emailing in to see if I can get some help with a new vehicle. My truck was stolen a week before Christmas, so I'm in the Aww. market for a new one. That's a bummer. Tough. I found one I like, but the price feels too high. Can I get some assistance, please? And thank you, Emmanuel. We wrote back, Emmanuel, the price for this 2018 Chevy Silverado feels too high because it is too high. Oh, good instincts there, Emmanuel. See the black book values that we have attached in the email. This is a perfect example of a vehicle listing that desperately needs to change. And in a moment, you'll see why. The miles are between 38 and 43,000 miles. Dealer is asking 39,994. If you didn't know, dealers try to keep their investment in a traded vehicle somewhere around 1,500 to 3,000 below average trade number or perhaps right at the rough trade value. Sure. You'll see this in an example coming up. Based on the most reliable dealer book values, Black Book pegs their cost at 28,625. If you look at the retail book out, their price is between extra clean retail at 41,725 and clean retail, which is 39,000. A 39,994 asking price is way too high in this current market and puts 11,369 bucks in their pocket. Way too much. It's ridiculous. Average retail on this vehicle, which is the highest any vehicle should be priced at the current market, is 35,650, which is $7,025 above their trade number and still adds $4,788 more in their pocket than the $2,237 profit that CarMax reported making on their cars. We say what's good enough for the biggest used car retailer in America is good enough for anyone else. <laughs> Soon enough, that truck will only have a market value of what's currently the rough retail number of 32,600, which will represent a much more modest profit for the dealer of 3,975 bucks. That's where the market is going, folks. A 22 to 30% drop or more. If they don't budge now, that's what's coming. I'd recommend waiting to see what happens with this one, Emmanuel, or look for a different truck. You could try to hit them with an offer of 30,862, which puts the $2,237 in their pocket, the CarMax profit, gives both of you a decent deal and stops a big loss from happening later to both of you as the market collapses further. If you decide to make an offer, Emmanuel, let us know how it goes. Best of luck to you. Before we get into the next couple examples, listen to this comment from our viewer, Brian Hall, who happens to have a 30-year career going as a current dealer. There's nothing former about this dealer, and he has the character you'd hope to find when car shopping. He shares direct proof that what we're saying about the current market is dead on the money. His comment reads, as a used car dealer of 30 years plus, I'm seeing other dealers at auction not spending near as much money for these cars anymore. And with the feds raising interest rates seven times in 2022, and the impact hasn't even been totally felt from all of those, we have more on the way. Hang in there, my fellow Americans. <laughs> Prices are falling. Thank you, Kevin and Elizabeth, for your honesty and great content. Looking forward to your next video. Well, Brian, you just earned a honorable mention on our video. This is a great dealer, you guys. And thanks for a current market confirmation from a good current dealer working right now in the car business. We'd love to do a video project with you, Brian. Email us at kevinthehomerickguy at gmail.com or shoot us a text 701-441-3399. At a minimum, we can add you to our behind the scenes THG consulting team. It's good people like you from around the country who help make our content deadly accurate. Yeah. We'd love to have you on board. As you will see shortly, we do feature good dealers we know around the country. This next vehicle example is priced right where we are seeing tons of vehicles fall in the current market. Here's a 2015 Chevy Tahoe. It has 91,949 miles on it and is in excellent shape. The dealer has it listed at 25,999 and that's pretty incredible. Now, why do we say this? 
The black book value showed that the extra clean retail book was 29,925. And that's exactly where the market was at its peak. Sure. But really nobody's getting those kinds of numbers on their vehicle right now. It's more like average retail, which is 25,850. Now, remember some time ago when we recommended that you get a cash offer from KBB on vehicles sitting right on a dealer's lot? This viewer did exactly that and received this cash offer of 20250 That number is right at the rough trade-in number on Black Book of 20335 You see how good this information is? Without help from anyone, you can take a VIN number and the miles of a vehicle that you're shopping for right off the dealer's lot and ask KBB for a cash offer on that vehicle. We can say with certainty that the cash offer they send you is the current wholesale value of the vehicle because black book values, the most dependable car book values known to dealers, totally agrees. We're going on 14 years and we've built a reputation for dependable and credible content here on YouTube. Our viewer Eugene Mitchum comments on our Don't Say I'm Paying Cash video from February 2021. This guy is great. I saved a lot of money watching his videos. Seeing the expression on the sales guy's face was priceless, <laughs> right on. When I did what the homework guy says, legit 100%. Thank you, Eugene. And by the way, folks, that video is so good. It's literally blowing up on our channel right now, despite being almost two years old. You see, we are known for publishing a lot of videos known as evergreen topics on this platform that survive the test of time. Make sure you check it out if you're a cash buyer candidate. It's rocket fuel from the amazing Elizabeth for current market car buyers. We don't want to end our show today without mentioning one of the most courageous and honest people that we know currently working in the car business. He's known on YouTube as the Chevy Dude, and he moved from the dealership he was working at to opening his own dealership known as Mike's Car Store. Mike's logo at the car store says, buying a car doesn't have to suck. It definitely doesn't have to suck. <laughs> It's right on the back wall as you enter in the store. That's right. Before we launched this show, we checked out several vehicle listings he has, and we can tell you with confidence that Mike Davenport, the Chevy dude, is leading the way, showing dealers how to properly treat car buyers and how to properly price vehicles in the current market. His vehicles are sitting at Black Book Average Dealer Retail Listing for most of his inventory, right where every dealer should be right now. We have spoken directly with Mike and he has agreed to come on our show to do an interview in the near future so he can share his vision with our audience. Something Mike is offering is a terrific service that most car dealers won't even touch. I actually got my dealer to do this years ago and very reluctantly I might add, but here it is and he advertises this on his website. You tell him what you're looking for, what your budget is, and he will find you that car. He'll make sure it's properly checked out and you'll have the dream car you've always wanted and you'll get it from an honest dealer known for years to look out for consumers. Without reservation, we endorse Mike Davenport on Mike's Car Store in Louisville, Kentucky. The best person to ever take on the title of dealer in all the years we've published our THG content. Help us blow up his website with car searches today and heat up his phone line 812-940-6453. With car requests from around the country if he doesn't already have what you need. By the way, either me or Kevin, or maybe both of us, will be making a trip to Mike's cars for the summer as we are in the market for a good used SUV. Mike will be our go to dealership. If it's good enough for the homework guy and the homework gal, it's good enough for you. It's good enough for you. It's totally worth it to buy a plane ticket from wherever you are to get to Mike's car store and support an honest dealer. I almost forgot to mention also before today is out. Go out and subscribe to his YouTube channel, The Chevy Dude, and tell Mike the homework I sent you. We appreciate your efforts, Mike. Now, let's get back to some unfinished business. The 22 plus percent drop we mentioned earlier is totally on the money, and there's more to come. Here are Black Book's Wholesale Market Insights for the week ending January 7th. That was just a few days ago. It says, with 2022 fully in the rearview mirror, we can begin to evaluate the year's performance. The overall market finished down 22.9% and cars down 22.7%, and trucks down 23%. More weekly updates coming as this trend continues. Folks, you absolutely have to hammer dealers right now on pricing, and with a bit of time, you'll get what you want. Just wait the 30, 60, 90 days that we've been recommending. If they don't move, walk away. Wow. Leave them with their overpriced inventory. If you'd like to show some gratitude for producing great car buying videos like this one today, the links for tips appearing on the screen will be easy to find in the description box below. PayPal, Cash App, and of course, Venmo. Our tip system was suggested to us by our viewing audience. Generous people ask for a way to donate to support our mission, and we offered PayPal at first, and then other viewers requested that we also add the Cash App and Venmo because they are popular forms of payment. Voluntary tips are awesome because they provide a good indicator to tell us how much you appreciate what we do, and apparently, 
You guys love us a lot, just like we love you. <laughs> and if you haven't noticed, we have been busy converting your tips into more free services for our viewers. If a tip is an option for you, no problem at all. Just show your thanks by subscribing and recommending our videos to your friends and family. I also want to remind our viewers about our very generous offer for free car buying assistance. Any viewer who has contacted us would tell you that you don't have to blow your hard-earned cash on a paid car club membership. Just send us a text to 701-441-3399 with your name and we'll be in touch with you. By the way, we are happy to get you prepared well ahead of time. And most of the time, you guys, you're reaching Liz. Yeah. <laughs> All right, if you're new here at the Homework Guide channel, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell. We thank you for subscribing and welcome you to our family. Thanks, everyone, for coming back. And to all of our faithful subscribers out there, you guys rock. God bless you all. I'm Kevin Hunter, the homework guy, signing off with the amazing Elizabeth, the homework gal. Once again, we're still earning your trust. See you next time. We, we gotta, gotta go. go.